Scott Herbert and welcome to The Secret Ingredient. We're in Chicago at the Whole Foods Market South Loop location and today's secret ingredient is organic Indonesian vanilla bean and we're going to make a nougat montalamar with that and I've got Chef Jeremy Brutskis here from Coco Rouge to show us how to do it. Jeremy, welcome. What is nougat montalamar? Nougat montalamar is basically an aerated confection. Okay. So uh, what we will be doing is whipping egg whites, incorporate a little bit of air, mm -hmm. and basically pouring hot sugar over that to set the protein in the egg and end up with a nice fluffy uh, uh, finished product. But it's similar Excellent. to a marshmallow. Okay. But without the gelatin, not quite okay. springy. Excellent. Excellent. Sounds great. Well, show us what we got to do. We want to start by heating up our honey. Okay. And the reason I'm going to start by heating the honey is I'm going to infuse my vanilla into the honey. Oh, excellent. So vanilla is a, a very expensive spice and it's uh, the more flavor you can get out of it, the better. So Yeah, why not, right? Uh, you can toast the pine nuts for me. Okay. On a medium heat? Yeah, you want a medium to low heat. You really okay. got to watch them. Initially, I like to start on a high heat just to get the pan, you know, pan going and then uh, turn it down. To okay. So when you cut vanilla bean, it's a good idea to kind of flatten the bean. Draw your knife on the side. And when you cut in this fashion, it's good to put pressure down on the side of your knife. So you're basically pushing down and gently sawing. So this is going to go in my pot with my honey. So two below honey. Once it simmers, I'll turn the heat off, let this infuse. Okay. I'll start my next. Uh... Excellent. Alright, so I'm going to add my sugar to the pan. Okay. I'm going to add my corn syrup. It's going to be three quarters of a cup. So I got my corn syrup, I'm going to add my water now. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to heat up my sugar to uh, 330, 330 degrees. So I'm inside. Actually, I want to make, give it a little bit of a mix, make sure the water is uh, incorporated, incorporated in there. Okay. Yeah. All right. So now I'm going to start my egg whites. All right. This is one and a half egg whites. Add a pinch of salt. So basically, in parallel, what we want to be doing is we want to be whipping our egg whites stiff. Okay. Have these ready for us. Um, at which point, we're going to pour the honey down the side and basically okay. temper off the egg white. How are my pine nuts coming along? I'm doing the hard part over here. Yeah, they look good. <laughs> Actually, I think they're about done. Is that about yeah. done? Okay. We'll take those off the heat. All right, so now we're going to grab the honey and put it in with the egg whites. That's right. Great. And you got to fish out the uh, vanilla beans first. got to fish out the vanilla beans. You want to get it on the uh, medium. Okay. And uh, the goal is to drizzle it down the side of the bowl. Oh, I got you. All right. And once you get the first bit in, you can you can pretty much add the you rest. Do it faster. Yeah. And then we're ready for the uh, sugar mixture. Ready for our sugar. Excellent. And this you, you this is a lot hotter than the honey was. So you you need to be careful at this point. Okay. So you want to turn up the speed. Being that the sugar's uh, much hotter than the honey was, you, you want to make sure it incorporates pretty well. Okay. Quick. Nice, oh yeah. Uh, nice ribbon. And so we use the whisk to incorporate air. And so now what's the paddle going to do that's different? The paddle is basically going to uh, incorporate the add-ins. Okay. Without uh, without breaking them. It will allow it to handle the chunkies. Exactly. I gotcha. So I like to start with the blueberries. Okay. I don't mind if they get uh, shredded a little bit and kind of dispersed with the mixture. Okay. Because the pine nuts I like to keep more whole. Oh yeah. Go ahead and add our pine nuts. Now is there, we, I would assume we want this as even as possible as, and it, you can't really do the shaking technique with this because it's so, so it's just basically you're kind of paddling it out, right? Yeah, you want to screw it up. It'll, it will level itself out to some degree. Okay. You get it as even as you can. Okay. Did I do a good job? You did a good job. All right. And so what's next? Um, at this point, you let it set overnight. Okay. And, uh, and cure a little bit more of the moisture will, will evaporate. Get a nice little skin on the outside. And is this in the refrigerator or is it just set out on the, on the counter? Would yeah. you cover it? You don't want to cover it. Okay. And you, don't, you, you definitely don't want to put it in the refrigerator because it'll absorb moisture from the refrigerator. Oh, okay. The, the sugar will absorb moisture okay. and it'll become sticky and wet. All right, Jeremy, so we have our finished product here. Now we just got to cut it out of this pan. Yeah. Show us how we do that. Turn it out of the pan. So you're going to have to run a knife around the side. Oh, but it's pretty soft. It is pretty soft. Here, dust the back a little bit of cornstarch. Now, well, I'm assuming prevent stickage from the other pieces once you've caught them? Exactly. Great, exactly. great. The edge, clean it, get a nice straight edge to start with. And the nougat, if it's not uh, if it's not coated in chocolate, it's going to want to kind of flatten out on its own. Okay, just run the pressure of the knife. Yeah, and actually just time. Just it's, time, it's okay, okay. Kind of All right. Lose its shape a little bit. 
and so this would be a great gift for really for any holiday, I would think, especially Christmas, Mother's Day, Valentine's Day. Absolutely. Let me uh, get a taste of this. Oh, I got a good piece with lots of stuff in it. Oh, it's fantastic. Thank you. And it doesn't stick to your teeth as much as I thought it might. No, no, it's, mm. it's, it's delicate. I mean, more, once at body temperature, it, it melts. It's got a nice soft wow. melting texture. Well, Jeremy, thanks for coming by The Secret Ingredient. Really appreciate it. Thanks for having me. All righty. Hi, my name is Linda Davis. I'm in the South Loop store in Chicago, and you're watching The Secret Ingredient.